first mystery box I ever opened was Culture Fly, a, a different Nintendo one. I feel like it was Nintendo, not Mario specific. So it was like Game Boy kind of backpack, and I had that for all my Switch stuff. And now, the reason why I opened up this fucking bag, box. Super Mario Brothers Weekender Bay. So I've been traveling a lot for wrestling recently and I've been staying over a lot of these places because I haven't been able to go home. And I need a weekend bag. So, uh, so the fact that it folds up on its own is cool. Little designs on it. Uh, oh, the little pocket actually becomes like a pocket on the weekend bag. I don't know. I don't have a weekend bag so I don't know if that's like a normal thing or not. But like, this is so dope. Hell yeah. This is, it's fucking big too. You can put your shit in here. Uh, I can put my dirty gear in here. I feel like I don't want to make this dirty though. I can put my clean gear and put my dirty gear back in my gear belt. So dope. Okay, now the fun part. Let me see if I can fold it. I don't know how this was folded. So I think I can. How the fuck was this folded to begin with? I feel like they just figured out, and they're like, you're never supposed to fold it again, brother. Unless I did. Oh, it is reversible. Oh my god, okay, that's great. I figured it out, I figured it out. Brute strength will get you somewhere in life. Not far, but somewhere. So that's why it has a double zipper on it, so you can nicely fold it in or just shove it in there. Fist it. Fist the sun bitch in there. Not family friendly. Language of this. Content, family friendly. Mentality, family friendly. Foul language, a plenty. <laughs> Brendan Caldwell, friendly, family friendly with foul language, a plenty. They're really fun, they're really fun. If you're watching the Rob Brennan of those, I got one more unboxing. Let me see if I can get it in. He did it, he got it. Ooh! Okay, so we got the pint glass, the throw blanket, the weekend bag. You got the two coasters, and it's cool, you got the coaster and fucking the pint glass, so it makes sense. Uh, you have the vinyl sticker. You have the cool enamel pin that slides. So if you're into pins, like this is like expert level pin. Uh, and then lastly, you have the beanie. So you want to want like 40 bucks, like if you say the beanie's 10 bucks, the throw blanket's 15, the weekend bag's 15, pint glass 10, 15, enamel pin. I think that this is so much worth your money. I feel like I might get another one or two of these to give away like little things as a gift. So if you're watching this and you're my friend and you like Mario, I'm probably gonna give you some shit.